Prince William was almost left stumped in the kitchen when he was asked to chop carrots during a visit to a homeless charity today. The Duke of Cambridge, 37, rolled up his shirt sleeves as he helped to prepare lunch during his visit to the passage, in London, hours after he was announced as patron. However he quickly realized there could be a problem when he picked up a bread knife and joked, this is going to go well. The royal soon settled into the food preparation line and peeled and chopped vegetables before serving hot meals in the cafeteria. Prince William, 36, first visited the charity with Princess Diana in 1993 and has returned a number of times in the decades since. One touching photo from 1994 shows a young Prince William and Prince Harry posing with their mother as they spent time at the centre. A second image shared by Kensington Palace today shows William's signature next to Princess Diana's in the visitor's book entry from December 1993. Today the father of three appeared in good spirits as he helped out at the centre, chopping vegetables and helping to serve food at lunchtime. William has become the figurehead of the passage an organization which has helped more than 130,000 people in crisis over almost 40 years through its resource center, homelessness prevention projects and innovative accommodation services. Cardinal Vincent Nichols, head of the Catholic Church in England and Wales and patron of the passage, welcomed the announcement ahead of the Duke's visit to the charity St. Vincent Center in Westminster. He said, I know the Duke is deeply committed to working with those most in need such as the thousands of people the passage has helped off the streets. It is crucial that everyone in our society, especially the poorest, are treated with respect, dignity and kindness, and are given the opportunities to fulfill their potential in life, this announcement is a tangible symbol of that commitment. William last visited the St. Vincent's Center with wife Kate in the run-up to Christmas, when he spoke out against the drug spice after hearing about its devastating effect on the capital's homeless. The Duke told Mick Clark, chief executive of the passage, the fact it was a legal high and that young people were allowed to take it and it leads to addiction is just terrible. The synthetic drug is seen as the biggest challenge the charity faces as it is cheap, readily available and can exacerbate existing problems like poor mental health. Following the announcement Mr. Clark said, during His Royal Highness's visits to the passage, it has been very clear that he has a deep concern for those affected by homelessness and a real interest in our work. For His Royal Highness to further express his support for the passage's work by becoming a royal patron is a tremendous honor, and a testament to how much he genuinely cares about this issue. Later William will join volunteers at the charity helping to prepare and serve lunch in what will be the first of several engagements for the Cambridges.